and welcome back to the final episode of my summer juice series thank you for participating and watching the videos i would like to know what juice was y'all's favorite in the comments so you know let me know it was six different juices so you know six different vibes and this last juice will be called the summer breeze juice it consists of ginger cucumber pear mango apple and oranges so this juice was really good it gave me like a tropical vibe i know i was going for a summer look in each juice so each juice gave me a different type of summer feel so i hope everyone enjoys it and you know this is the final episode i just want to tell y'all thank you in a live kind of way this isn't live but you know what i mean um yeah so now i have to clean up <laughs> so i did start off by washing off my fruits and vegetables with the trader joe's fruit and vegetable wash and i just gave everything a good rub scrub and just kept it moving on that and as you could see everything was really really fresh looking and nice and i did my grocery shopping at central market and central market is a store that's located in houston and it's like a it's under the company H-E-B, which is like my favorite grocery store. So Central Market is like, they classify it as a gourmet style of grocery shopping. And as you know, gourmet, when you hear the word gourmet and stuff, you already know it's pricey. So it's a bit pricier, but it's really nice. I don't do my exclusive grocery shopping there because I do go to H-E-B. But I go there every once in a while just because it's like a really nice store and they have all types of weird stuff in there that's like, I'm like, okay, I'll try this. And it's just, you know, it's a lot, but... I do like it and you know I go there sometimes so I started off by not slicing but taking the skin off of the cucumbers and you know I just like to do that and I use regular cucumbers like you know just the regular two for a dollar cucumbers and they work just fine and also if you can see with the mango I did only opt to use one I know I washed two but I just used the other one as you know just to cut it up and eat it as some regular fruit for me I didn't want to juice too many, you know, sweets in the juice. We already had the pears, the apples, the mango and everything and the oranges. So I just, you know, I kept it, I kept a balance. So the mango was really good. It was a good addition to this juice. I did like the overall taste of the juice. And yeah, a lot of people were saying I had, like I posted on my Instagram story. They were like, this sound good. Like this blend sound real good. And it really was. But keep in mind when you're using apple, pear and ginger and one juice you know just keep in mind that that is something <laughs> it's good but you know it has some sort some sort of a detox to it but it's really good i like the taste of it it all worked out really good and i also wanted to go over the cost breakdown i actually only spent $16, $16.76 with, for all the ingredients. And that was the inclusion of that extra mango. So if you take that off, it's like a dollar off. But we'll just keep it in the calculations because this was all one receipt. And I made a total of five juices. And that was about $3.35 per juice. So, you know, this for the fruits and vegetables that were used in this juice, you know, that was pretty cheap. Considering if I was to go buy a juice with all of these ingredients at a juice shop or something, I would probably be at ten dollars but you know we do this at home so these apples they are classified as lemonade apples and i looked at the origin of them and they're from new zealand so that's different and they did taste good i liked them so that was cool and that's another thing about central market they have a whole apple section that's like so many different types of apples i never heard of they have a bunch of pear selections oranges it's like so many different varieties of one particular fruit and you know you can always just taste test things so that's what i like about the store but you know most stores are like that but that store is just like really different to me so i just did that and i really appreciate everyone tuning into the summer juice series it's summer's not over but the series is but i really enjoyed this and i want y'all to know that the videos will be coming consistently i've been planning out videos for that'll last me for the next two months so just know we'll have something coming once a week please don't i'm not gonna say any dates because you know life is busy but at least once a week so keep that in mind and we're gonna be exp i'm gonna be expanding more on my videos i want y'all to see how i be how i meal prep how i fruit prep how i just prep up the ingredients for a week just so i can have stuff available for when i want to cook it so we're gonna just be going beyond that cooking videos everything like 
the only thing i would say about my cooking videos i do not eat sauces so don't think like i'm one of those i'm a i'm not a picky eater but i'm a picky eater but I, i'm only a picky eater i'm a picky eater but okay so i don't eat sauces however i do like my food to be really good so it still comes out good and i always get compliments on how the food look in the presentation so you know cooking videos coming soon uh another thing i would like to say is that i really appreciate everyone and the support that y'all give me on my videos that's another thing i know i said that in my other video but let's reiterate i love i love the support the natural engagement engagement everything is really it's really touching to me so thank you for tuning in so i did go ahead and pour everything you know i did my whisk can we call it the super whisk <laughs> No, I mean, I said it, but I just did everything super fast and I poured the juice and I was like, oh my gosh, this is so good. So I then I poured it into the bottles and I had my three bottles available. And then I was like, well, hold up, we still have another, you know, we still need to find another bottle. So I had to go get another bottle. I had already did my super shakes, but I found another bottle and I was able to pour the rest of the juice in that bottle and yeah i just filled the rest of it up and i did some more super shakes just because it's just something to do so i just super shaked it all one more time and you know we were done so thank you for watching my video goodbye